Given the lasting impression that Godzilla and Mothra have had on you throughout your life, how have these characters manifested themselves in your poetry? In Carbon Footprint, they, manis they manifest themselves at least a couple of times. I have a poem titled Mary Sue, which is about my love of writing Godzilla fan fiction and how that kind of served as a form of escapism for me when I was a teenager. And I wrote another poem in Carbon Footprint titled Joman Suji, which is about uh, a, the one Mothra movie where Mothra travels to a, an island in southern Japan and she cocoons herself against this tree that's thousands and thousands of years old and I've just always been kind of obsessed with this place. So both Godzilla and Mothra have kind of acted as a form of escape for me and that's how both of them have manifested themselves in this book. They will be occurring more frequently in my next book, however.